Hello everybody and welcome to another exciting episode of Banana Craft. I'm your host Banana Man and today we have a fantastic day all figured out for you. I haven't played on the server in quite a while and I wanted to apologize first of all for the lack of videos recently. Um, I forgot to mention that I was going to my sister Loopy's house uh, over the weekend and during that time I was planning on making a video but I didn't exactly get around to it and so I didn't get a video out and I'm sorry it was supposed to be out today but it was going to be fancy and I'm going to still try and do it because... Um, What's happening, the reason I, I went over to my sister Loopy's house is because she's having a garage sale and my mom was going to help her out with it and we just kind of came along to visit. Um, so we were there for a few days and my mom is still over there. She's helping out with the garage sale. And then my dad and I, we're going back to get her on Sunday and bring her back home. So I will still have the opportunity to possibly make a fancy video with her. Um, we'll have to see how that turns out. I'm going to try though. So in the meantime... I just wanted to apologize for the lack of videos recently and not giving you guys any notice. I have been paying attention to YouTube though and I've been trying to uh, respond to comments even, even though there haven't been that many. I, I'm trying to respond to them. I don't even know what I'm saying right now. But um, today we are doing a video and whoa we got a lot of payment in here. What did people buy? Somebody bought some lots of something if they put 59 iron in there. Let me just check and see how the coffee's selling we sold three of those sold four of those none of the, those but we sold three of those whoa okay so herbal tea is apparently a very popular product i'll be sure to make more of that visit tea and uh, espresso not bad not bad it looks like two of the cds sold too the ones that are only iron because these Oh, no, these are all iron, except for that one, because that's a good one. That's a rare one. The other ones are not that hard to find. So I'll need to restock all this stuff. But hey, 59 iron, that is not bad payment. That was... It worked out pretty good. So today we're going to show off a few things more on the server. And then I had an idea for something fun that I wanted to try. Um, I don't know why the frames are so low right now. Am I using the right shaders? I might be using the wrong shaders. Yeah, we get a lot more frames with this one. I'm sorry. The other one looks kind of fancier, but it's better for time lapses than for actual recording. And let's also check the mail. I haven't done this in a long time, and I need to put my little banner on it. Everybody else is putting their banner on, and it looks cool. Why haven't I done that? I don't know. So I'll do that too, but wow, we got lots of lucky chicken. A banana stand to put armor on. Banana armor stuff. I don't have enough room in here because I got all this junk. What am I supposed to do with it? I got some random nether rack that I don't need. Let me just uh, throw it out here. Nobody's going to mind if I just dump it down this hole, I'm sure. There we go. And uh, I want to keep the cactus, but I can dump the dandelion. Okay, let's go get that banana armor. And I can put that in my house. It looks so fancy. Or I could put it on myself because I'm not wearing anything right now. So let me just get all that stuff. Put that on. Thank you. We got high. What's this say? Banana man. Here's a banana costume and a banana stand to put it on. So fancy, Mr. Beano. Thank you, Mr. Beano. It is most fancy indeed. I look fantastic. And then to my brother from my sister who I just got back from visiting. What's this say? It's me, your bestest sister ever. I thank you for your letter and look forward to many more fan letters. I'm sure you don't get as much as I do, so I thought I'd keep you from getting bored. Anyway, we've had a lot of cool adventures together and hope to have many more. Our recent contribution to society in the way of the school size courthouse has been a great accomplishment indeed. And that's going to make this snake statement hard to say, but I must say it. I'm afraid you... you are... that is to say, you are... You're fired? What? <laughs> I know this may come as a shock. Indeed it does. But we can't keep competing for the overtaking of the world and its subject. I know you had your heart set on world dominance. But I don't think you have the power or of influence that it takes to bring the world under your control. And so, my dear brother, I must continue the quest for world dominance on my own. You understand, right, <laughs> Well, she thinks she can take over the world without me. You bananas are with me. We are in this together. I was never in it for the world domination anyway. Pff, no way. I was, I was, you guys come first. You know I care about you so much. And I do my best to make good videos for you guys. World domination was never part of the plan. And 
and I don't really know where I'm going with that, but that's a funny letter. So if you're watching this, Loopy, thank you very much. I appreciate it. That made my day. Okay, so a couple things I'm going to show off today is a little bit more around our Banana Hub region and then something that I happened to stumble across while I was in the Banana Hub region, or exiting actually, because um, I found something new. And there's a dog there. There's random dogs appearing everywhere, and I have no idea why or where they come from they're just randomly sitting in different places I don't know if there's one person that has dogs that just kind of leaves them there oh look out of the way robo pig man I gotta get through here is there whoa oh, okay they just broke the door down I was thinking that there was some new addition to the nether hub but I guess not okay so Right out here outside spawn, you can see we got our wonderful, beautiful observatory. And then Leon, Sama, and I were um, fidd fiddling around a while ago. And I don't know who put all these chickens here, but we built this um, this little snowball arena area thing because you got to have fun when you're playing Minecraft. And we didn't have too many like games to play around with. So we built this little thing here. Two people or four. I guess you can have four people or however many you want on this thing. You chicken, you laying eggs on it. That's not nice. You got to get out of here. Um, but anyway, you get as many people as you want on here. Load them all up with snowballs. And then you all try to knock each other off. And the last person standing wins. So very simple game. But it was also a lot of fun. We had fun with that. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it for that. Also, she added some great new addition to her house. It looks fantastic. We'll go take a look at that in a little bit here. But there was something I wanted to show off first if I can find the way back to that um first of all i'm gonna put the mail and stuff into my mailbox or not my mailbox but my area where i keep the mails at and what's this oh that's my facebook i forgot about that did i show that off last time i think i did but just in case i didn't this is a book with a face in it snort get it and then anonymous is what oh no viruses I don't know who did that, but somebody somebody hacked my book. That's not that's not good. But I didn't sign it anyway, so I guess anybody can add whatever they want to it. Uh let's see. Where where do I keep the mails at? What's this? Stone stuff. Oh, I didn't see this. Hello, I had to take the bottom part off the snow battle tower thingy so Patrick could build something underwater. Oh, okay. So here's a stone back. Have a wonderful day. Oh, Thank you, Leon Sama. I didn't even notice, but I guess there's the stuff. And that means Patrick built something new, too. Oh, my goodness. There's lots of stuff that I didn't even know was happening that's all of a sudden happening. And I just realized, too, that I keep all my mails at the um, coffee shop at Starblocks. So I shouldn't have taken them with me. I should have gone that way. But let's see what Patrick's done here. Because, obviously, if, he, if we had to remove the tower thing... Oh, this is new. What is this? This almost looks like a cemetery. Oh! Okay, this is an auto flower collector, I think. How does this work? Whoa! Is that just... It just... Okay, I I'm guessing there's like fertilizer behind these? If I can... Here. Oh, sorry. I'll fix it. Yeah, it's a bunch of fertilizer. That's cool. So you can just like spam make flowers. That's really awesome. I didn't know that I didn't know you could do that, but that's really cool. You can make lots of roses, lots of sunflowers, any any two stack flower, I guess. That's really interesting. And then I'm guessing this is right below the Wait, where where is the snow snowball thing? Is it right over here? It might be. No, that's the lily pads. Huh. I wonder where he's building that at then. All right, I'm going to take a quick poke. <gasps> whoa! I'm sorry, Patrick, if this was supposed to be a secret, but whoa! This is a big project, whatever it is. Wow. Is that all? That Yeah, that's all glass. I don't know what he's building here, but this is looking pretty fancy, whatever it is. Oh, and there's snowmans in it, but that's okay. Uh, sorry if this was supposed to be a secret, Patrick. I, I realize you probably had it blocked off for a reason, but I, I won't snoop around anymore. Just pretend that never happened, okay? Oh, and frames dropped again. I don't know what's wrong with them. 
but I apologize if it lowers the viewing quality. And there's his banner, I guess. Okay, so it's starting to get dark out, which is no good for showing off the thing that I wanted to. I wanted to show it off during the day, but that's okay. Um, while we are waiting for daytime to arrive, let's go check out Leanne's house again because it's uh, it looks fancy during any time of the day. Because it's got lights and everything. But the thing that I'm going to show off to you later, it doesn't have lights on it. So that's why I'll wait until daytime. And I think my phone just rang. But I'm kind of recording, so I'll have to answer it later because I, it already stopped ringing. Also, do I have another banana banner in here? Yes, I do. I will take one of those. Thank you very much. There we go. The frames are starting to climb again. I don't know why they are going down. Everything should be fine, but you never know sometimes. So, yeah, I'll go check out her house. Go back to the mailbox. Put my banner over it. Go to Starbucks. Put my mail where it goes. And then it'll all be hunky doy. Okay. So we go up this newly added, was this here before? I don't remember, but this is fairly new, the little walkway up to here. And then we go out through here and down through here. Oh yes, this is another addition here. Did I show this off last time? If I did, I apologize. But she's got um, a little addition to her barn here where she keeps the rabbits and the horse that she has. And then over through here we got to go up and around the house actually let me just throw my teleportation device up onto there Shapow! and then we go in through here and we have this wonderful spiral staircase that you go all the way up it all the way just keep going keep going and then we have this awesome balcony here complete with more teleportation devices and what we did here was we had myself leanne and ty we were all up here and we were trying to see which of us could throw it the farthest to make it um as far as we could using that and i don't know if this game has inertia or momentum carried in it like if you can run and throw it farther but it it kind of felt like it and so we were trying to see who could make it the farthest and i wonder if it's possible to land on the little snowball arena there I, I don't know I haven't tried it yet but I suppose we could and then you can climb up the ladder up the back here if you want to get up even higher when there's snow here this is a good place for collecting snowballs for going to the arena so it's like you could just collect all the snowballs warp over there and then you'll be ready to go so to demonstrate we just go down the ladder go to the box grab one of these pop it in our inventory and I got to pop it over there. There we go. And then we got our shovel, our handy dandy stone spade. And we're going to grab up some snowballs like this. Just like that. And then we go and we get ready. I'm going to aim right for that thing. So let's do it. We go and jump and throw it. And there it goes. I think I missed by just a bit. Oh, underwater. Actually, I missed by quite a bit, but that's okay. We still did fairly well, I think. We almost got near to it, but if we had made it, then we just would have been up on here already. We wouldn't have had to climb the ladder. Nobody even saw us coming, and we just spam snowballs everywhere and vanquished them all just like that. Man. Well, I, I guess even if um, I wasn't supposed to go through the wall. You would have been able to see it right now. So it's not like Patrick expected it to remain hidden. But I do wonder what he is working on. Patrick, if you're watching this, could you please explain a little bit about the situation? I would, un uh, I would understand. I would appreciate it. Because then I would know what's going on. Okay, so. Still nighttime. I don't want that card. I want this card. Excuse me, Mr. Pigman. I need to get through, so please don't be blocking the railroad. Good job. Glad to see that you are not doing so. We are going to go back to the spawn. And we are going to go to the mailbox, put my banner on, put the stuff in the coffee shop. I've already said this, so you guys already know. But I don't remember what else I was trying to say. So I'm just repeating myself because got nothing better to do. Okay. Whoa, whoa, bit of lag right there. But we're all right. Okay, so we go in through here. Let's attach our banner just like so. Oh, that's not right. Uh, uh, let's get that adjusted. Oh, I'm sorry. I'll fix that later. I don't have glass on me right now. Oh, did he? How'd you? What? He? What? 
There we go. <laughs> Is that how he did it? I guess so. Huh. I need some glass. I'm sure there's some around here somewhere. Or I could take... I, I've got some in the coffee shop. So I'll get that while I'm putting uh, the mail into the mail chest. Okay. Dum -dum 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 -dum. How many of you were out there have seen the uh, the digital event that Nintendo did this year? Uh, it was it was interesting. It, it wasn't showing off too much. Personally, I was a little bit disappointed, but they did have the most amazing puppets that I have ever seen in a Nintendo thing. Okay, so here we go. We're gonna put all the stuff in here all those letters and then i'm sure i had some glass here it's probably in one of the furnaces if oh come on i know oh did i turn it all into bottles i might have done that but i should have some sand if not glass uh, i don't think i do so i'll have to get some glass and fix that and since it's still nighttime, I might as well go collect some sand right now. Seeing as I'm going to need it for more glasses in the future anyway. Um, but anyway, about the, the Nintendo Digital event, um, besides the semi-disappointingness, there was some cool stuff that they showed off. Uh, the new Star Fox looks pretty good so far, as well as the... What was it? There was another thing. Uh, the new Fire Emblem, that looks really good too. Um, but they didn't really show off too much of either of them. More more so Star Fox and Fire Emblem. But it, it looked pretty good. And um, about those puppets though, I was kind of wondering if there's a place out there where you can like send in a picture of yourself and they'll make a puppet out of you. Because that would be pretty fancy if you could do that. It's probably really expensive. Uh, but I bet you there's something out there that you can do that at. And, you know, should I be taking sand from here or is somebody going to get upset if I do that? I don't think anybody lives here. And plus I can replace it with dirt so it should be okay. Nobody should really notice. But hopefully nobody gets upset that I took some sand. If they do, I'll, I'll pay them back with sand. But I don't think anybody hangs out here. So it should be okay. Uh, let me just even out the layout of this a bit and then just uh, take that and there we go everything's fine there was n there was no sand there before you kidding me no there's never been any sand there I also forgot to put the carpet back but that's okay I'm on my way back anyway is, is that the same as it's ever always been I don't know that looks different or new what is this? What is this building? M Macrio's house? I've never seen a Macrio on the server before. I don't know if he's new or old, but looks like he has a pretty fancy house here. That's cool. Hmm. Macrio. Can't say I've seen him. And then. I forget if Razgris built that thing over there. That's been there for a while, though. What is this? I, I can't remember. I apologize if you guys remember and I'm repeating stuff. But uh, King Size, he's the one that built the um, little hotel apartment thing at the start of Spawn. He builds fancy stuff. I like his designs. Yep. Pretty simple looking. He's got cake on the table there. Just some interesting layout going on there. Very nice, very nice. I'll close your gate for you in case you would prefer that. I haven't seen him here recently either, but I don't know if he plays more during the night or during time when I'm not here. Not entirely sure, but you know, whatever. Okay, so we're going to go back, put the carpet down on my floor where it belongs, and then... Check out the thing that I wanted to show you guys before it gets too dark again. Yeah, that's the plan. Okay. So, okay, let me just put this carpet back. Do, do, do. Get in here. All right. Plop that down. Oops, sorry. Plop. 
Oh, glass. That's what I was supposed to do. But I'll do that uh, off camera. And I promise I won't forget this time. I know a lot of times I say I'm going to do something like the hole that I was supposed to fill in in Ty's uh, land. And I kind of forgot to do that. And he did it. But thankfully, he wasn't upset. He was all okay with it. Speaking of which, do you sell any more uh, TNT recently? <gasps> he does. How many is in here? 21. Is it still the same price? Two iron for one block. Oh, snap. He raised the price. What's 21 times 2? That's 42. So let me just uh, get this down a bit. Okay. Yeah, that's that's good. Okay. Pay here in the, the book and quill where I pay for stuff. Okay, here we go. Uh, let's see. Six iron for six TNT. Okay, banana man. Uh, and this time it's... Uh, 42 iron for uh, 21 TNT. Okay, there we go. There's uh, that, and there's your payment. I uh, make sure, yeah, 42 is right. Okay, thank you, Ty. I appreciate the TNT. I'm going to be using this later, but I'm not going to say what for. And no, it's not to blow up somebody's house. Um, okay, I think we're good. Yes, okay, so the direction that I need to be going in is this way. Uh, I found it on my way from the banana hub to spawn because Ty made a little pathway. Um, but this time we're going to go the, the backwards way around. We're going to go from spawn back to the banana hub. And as you can see, there's a lot of de-leaved trees here. And it's like, hmm, I wonder why the, all these trees have no leaves. And I really don't know why the reason for that. But uh, I think it probably has something to do with this thing that we're about to happen upon. There you go. You can start to see leaves appearing in the sky. Look at this thing as it slowly renders into the distance. Oh, even built a little makeshift path thing here. It's like Loopy's treehouse, but different and crazy. But it's still very awesome. I have no idea what it looks like up close because I wanted to capture that on camera for the first time. It's built by a special K. She's still working on it as far as I know. But she gave us the okay to... Um, come and take a look at it i'm pretty excited because it looks awesome from this view at least so let's see uh how we go about getting inside there's lots of pumpkins okay here we go don't mind me that's cool self-closing uh donations of dark oak wood to special oh to yeah special k is recommended not appreciated but recommended specials to-do list burn your shop Work on tree branches, separate rooms, floors. Make stables look better. Find four name tags. Find a dog. Return two saddles to tie. Huh. It's like a... It's, it's, it's exactly what it is. It's a to-do list. And I don't know whose shop is your shop. But hopefully not my shop. Because my shop is directly across the way from Special K's shop. But this is awesome. Look at this. It's like... It's it's different from Loopy's house because Loopy's house has the walls all made out of wood, and I like that. But I also like this too because you can see through the walls uh, a little bit since they're made out of leaves instead of uh, the actual wood, and it's just a straight ladder with this house. I guess no stairs, but wow, this is really cool. Are these chests or what's what's this? Almighty Dead Rabbit Shrine. Oh, interesting. That's kind of creepy. We also got a lot of banners over here. Uh, this means owned by Special K. This means it's Special's Farms. This means Special's Bedroom. This means Special's Animal Farm. This means it's Special's Skyroom America. <laughs> this means Special's spatial Storage Room. Oh, I get it. It's a play on word. Huh, huh. Okay, so that's this is cool. And what's this? It's a diamond pumpkin. Oh. First diamond, <laughs> the, the sun shines directly on it. That's really cool. Okay, and then some kind of auto cooking system going on there. Very nice. All right, this is cool. The, the higher it goes up, the more I like this house. It's got more and more stuff going on. Got a little lake here. Uh, is this the bedroom? I'm not sure. I didn't really pay attention to what the different banners meant. 
We got all these different kinds of armors going on here. I don't know why so many, but I guess you got something to wear for every day of the week plus one. There's eight. Hey, or is there more than eight? No, just eight. Okay. Okay, so that's cool. And then we go up. Is there anything special about this? No, not really. Okay, go up to the very tippy top, I think we're reaching. And sorry if it's a bit dark. I realize the shaders kind of make it a bit difficult to see. But it's not too bad. Whoa, okay, this is the this is the storage room, I think. Oh, it sounds like specials up there working on the house. But man, you got a lot of stuff going on here, Special K. This is pretty cool. Wow, this is like a, a full-on arena or whatever. It's it's huge. I, I'm guessing this is the Sky Room, but man, this must have taken a lot of time and work. That's very commendable, Special K. You are doing a great job with this. Man, this is cool. Are you going to like have water flowing down into that? Or I, I don't know. I don't know what Special is planning to do with her house, but this does look pretty amazing. And I, I don't know where she's at, but she's crunching leaves somewhere. Oh, there she is. Hello, Special K. This is absolutely fantastic. I don't know if you watch the show, but if you are watching right now, then thank you so much for letting me tour your house. This is this is some house, and man, I don't know how long it's taken you to do this, but I don't think I would be capable of doing something like this. This is a lot of work going on here, but man, it's very fancy, very fancy. You got a tree right here. Is this where you harvest your wood? Probably. And then where does this go to? I'm sure this ends up somewhere near the spawn because um, it's it's right next to the spawn portal. Whoa. Completely. Okay, I was going to say it's completely encased. What's this? Special case portal. No kidding. Uh, I can't see anything. There we go. Torch helps everything. Oh, I know where this is. Okay. Uh, where is mm, the way back? And also, what's that? This is unfamiliar. Oh, wait, no, these are stairs. My, my bad. Never mind. I don't know what I'm doing. This connects to my portal area right here. You go down through here and then out through the doors. And then you're right there at my place. Yeah. Okay. Very cool. So we've been going for a good amount of time here. Thank you all so much for watching. I, again, apologize for the lack of videos as of late. And I will be doing more uh, more often now. Um I'm still going to try and get a special video done with my sister Loopy if possible. If it doesn't work out, then I apologize for getting your hopes up, but I'm really going to try my best to get something cool for you guys. So thank you all again so much. I apologize also if I was a little bit tired this video, because I am a little bit tired, but I'm still good enough to semi-comprehend what I'm saying, even though most of the time I don't understand anything. But... That's besides the point. Thank you all again so much. I'm repeating everything I say from now on. So I will catch you all in the next episode. And thank you, Mr. Beano, for the fantastic armor. I look fantastic. And I will see you all next time in the next episode of whatever it is we are doing. Don't forget to check out the straw poll in the description of this video for what you want to see next. Thank you, everybody that voted on Minecraft for this video. And we will see what's up next according to you guys. Alright, until next time, goodbye.